Welcome everyone to another video and in this video we are going to be featuring a team from I play tennis lol not sure that's the name of their team or this trainer is always literally laughing out loud while playing tennis anyways there's no laughing about this team uh, this team consists of hypno uh, registeel and cliff fable and you know cliff fable kind of gets outshone outshone by the other charmer shadow gardevoir wigglytuff even other fairies like azumarill uh, but clefable has some like pretty good stats it also got the recent moon blast uh buff i'm not sure if i play tennis is using uh moon blast but let's go ahead and take a look at some of the battles all right we're leading registeel into altaria generally a favorable matchup for oh okay uh, that's good that's good uh, generally a favorable matchup for uh registeel uh because uh, altaria does have to be down a shield in order to to win that matchup and uh the fact that they switched out a little bit late is actually a little bit favorable uh as long as you win switch advantage that's really the key hypno can win a lot of neutral matchups uh so i guess and, and he is also carrying fire punch on his hypno in case he gets matched up with registeel so really a really positive situation um and this is probably going to be a hydro pump it is does quite a bit of damage and we're going to see whether or not this azumarill is going to commit two shields or not it, it looks like it is and so we're going to switch out into hypno uh, are we going to see the counter switch uh into altaria or perhaps even to registeel let's see I guess the confu going confusion down is the play. Uh, gonna have to shield? Maybe doesn't? I don't know. It's a tough call. Okay, let's see what's gonna come out. Is it gonna be the Altaria? It's gonna be Shift Tree. Whoa! Whoa, okay. Okay, has a lot of energy. Just completely sacrificed it. But Cafable, to be honest, would have destroyed both these Pokemon. Um, and then here comes Clefable, and this matchup is over. This Altaria wants none of this Clefable action. Very interesting. Um, very interesting farm down strategy, too. That's not something I wouldn't necessarily have done, but it worked out really well for I play tennis. So, some notes for, for me to, to take. All right, we're gonna go into this second game. Registeel into Victory Bell, very positive matchup. Um, gonna stay, probably because they have Bastidon in the back, which actually would be pretty bad. Uh, definitely gonna look to soften this uh, thing up. I can imagine that they're gonna two shield. Oh, here comes Defense Deoxys. Uh, probably gonna switch out into Clefable. This is not great if they have Bastion on the back. Um, maybe, let's see. Uh, a Rock Slide going to come through. Probably another Rock Slide after this. If we can get to one, it definitely should be able to. Nope. Uh, the last charm was able to KO before the Rock Slide came through. Are we going to see the Victory Bell come back out? We are going to have to burn a shield or... Let's see. Yes, it's going to burn a shield. Oh my gosh, this thing is so annoying. But you're definitely going to see Hypno come through. And I think we'll see an Acid Spray. No, we're going to go Registeel. Interesting. Is this going to be an Acid Spray? It is an Acid Spray. Going to immediately switch out into Hypno. And we're going to see the Confusion go down. And we see our good friend Bastidon. Why not? And the Shadow Ball is not going to do that much damage. Uh, and these Confusions are resisted. But two shields up. Uh, and uh, Reggie's not nerfed again. Should be a clear win for, uh, for I play tennis. Oh man, Bastidon. And then it's basically, it's in Flash Cannon range now. Uh, yeah, definitely in Flash Cannon range. But they're going to quit out. 
Oh man, Victory Bell. So I would have, I don't know, it's debatable. Probably should stay in with Victory Bell. Um, it's got, it's tricky. Like these, uh, that kind of lead is, uh, is tricky to work with. Okay, so in a very favorable matchup right now. And we're definitely going to see the switch out. And going to switch out into Clefable, into Snorlax. My gosh, okay. All right. Um, definitely a body slam. I imagine we're going to see one more body slam before. Yes, we are uh, going to shield. Can it get to another one? Might be able to th might throw the meteor mash. Uh, yeah, we're going to throw because it very unlikely would KO. And I think we're going to see Skarmory come back out. Oh, shield. OK, hmm. Clefable can just shield again and then charm down. But are we going to see the switch out into, yes, we are, switch out to Skarmory. I'm not, yeah, I'm not 100% in love with that particular switch just because uh, if you were to caught the Meteor Mash, then it would have made a little bit more sense. But, um, yeah, let's see how they play this out. Okay, no shield. And I imagine I play tennis is going to over farm to 100 energy. Basically, two more lock-ons, and then I expect the... F or or a potential farm down. Oh, man. That is a... I think that's, that's a lot. It's going to be able to survive this just barely. And then I imagine an immediate flash cannon. Oh, yeah. They try to lick down. But, uh, yeah, this is too much. Uh, going to switch out. Okay. Um... This is not a good situation at all. Uh, gonna have to sack. Yeah, I don't see the win here. Yeah, here comes a blizzard. If it would have sacked the the Clefable to catch this. Oh, whoa, it's just a mud bomb. And another mud bomb coming through. It's. I think it's better to go blizzard. Uh, but this is a very favorable matchup. The thing is, like, I guess Blizzard, if even if they do sack it, it's not that much wasted energy. Um, so, uh, uh, if they mud bomb, it's it's not that much wasted energy. So, it's a good situation. Uh, oh man, Shadow Ball does connect. That is absolutely huge. No shields, no shields left. The Skarmory has like almost no HP left. So really nice play. That was a very, very close game. Uh, extremely close game and really well played uh, by the opponent as well. And we are going to go into this next game. Meganium, uh, Registeel, definitely not going to switch out. It's a fairly even matchup. Um, Registeel obviously resisting the Vine Whips and Frenzy plan, but is going to take a lot of damage from Earthquake, so we definitely have to be careful of the Earthquake. It's going to be a bait. Oh, no, no bait. Just going to go straight for the Earthquake. It does allow Registeel to have a little bit of an energy advantage because now Meganium has to land the Earthquake. It just depends on when it's going to be. But after shielding that first Earthquake, it's, it's pretty tough for... Meganium to eventually win out this match, but that certainly helps. And it's going to have to go down a shield advantage. Might shield and then try to farm down. Nope, just going to let it go. It was a play, but it's kind of risky, especially if they have a flyer. Could switch out into Hypno. Are we going to see the counter switch? Not going to shield this. Hypno is very tanky. Thunderbolt coming through. Are they going to shield the Shadow Ball? Shadow Ball is not like overly common. I think Double Punches is the most common in GBL, but... Oh, here comes Alolan Sand Slash. This is actually really bad for I Play Tennis. Uh, Pokemon that you generally... Oh, they actually no shield the Fire. Uh, that's double super effective. Uh, this is going to be an Ice Punch. I don't know if it KOs. Does not, but that actually might be better. Going to try to charm down... This Alolan um, Sand Slash. This is just going to be an Ice Punch. Um, and then let's see. Going to go for 
Okay, yeah, this is a very good situation. Resist the counters, and we're going to see another opponent uh, leave the match. Oh, man. This, these fire punches are quite timely. That's why I love Hypno so much. You just really can't predict what the moveset is. You would think, like, Shadow Ball, you would think Thunder Punch or Ice Punch. But Fire Punch is apparently the way to go in this particular situation. Okay, we're going to end up in the Registeel Mirror. Not a, not a mirror I love, to be honest. Uh, I definitely don't enjoy playing it, playing out this mirror. It's way too much of a guessing game for me. Um, and they shield the flash cannon. They did get another lock on through, so that might be that might play out to something significant. Oh, they shield the flash cannon. All right. Yeah, because of the extra lock on they got, they did they were ahead. Uh, so this is going to be a focus blast. That's not good for I play tennis and are we going to see the shield if this shield comes through? That's really huge No shield um, And then we see the immediate switch out and then unfortunately haunter gonna be met by hypno Hypno is gonna have to shield one of these or well, maybe not uh, does it get to two punches? Uh, maybe he doesn't actually does not. Well, yeah. Yeah, that's what I thought All right but has energy. Is that going to convert to anything significant? This Registeel is very low. But is it? Okay. Here comes Meganium. Meganium cannot. Oh, maybe it can. Vine Whip down. That is a lot. It looks like it can. And okay. Very nice switch. Um, oh, I, I think you just still hit the bubbles, right? I don't know if like. Getting energy on Cliff Fable really means anything. Uh, maybe it does. Let's see. It got like two charms through. I think. Yeah. Uh, I. Maybe it matters. Maybe it matters. It, it, it's. Yeah. Maybe it does. Let's see. Okay. L looks like it's not going to pay off. Yeah. It was going to be a little bit too much to. To. Uh, to overcome. And then this uh, Hypno is very low. So really nice switch by the opponent. But I really don't know how I play tennis could have played that last matchup uh, any differently. So GG. Thank you for sharing this video. Uh, let me know down in the comment section below what you think of Clefable at, and its potential use in Go Battle League. You think that other charmers uh, outclass it? Do you think a charmer has any role in this meta where it's so dominated by Registeel. Let me know down in the comment section below and I'll see everyone in the next